All right, so now, out of the same formation, we're going to go uh, PA crosses, gun trips, flex, tight end, right? Junk, gun trips, tight end, flex, all right? We'll go cover three. Cover three, right? Cover three, purple. Cover three, purple. So you have this. Only thing you want to do is Williams, the triangle route, put triangle on a hitch, R2. So triangle... R2, right? That's all you want to do, and then put square on a comeback route, like that. And you would think this route, like, there's no way this route can get open, right? Your main read is always triangle, okay? Now, O is, is basically unguardable. The user, 9 out of 10, is going to guard O, but guess what he's going to do when you start hitting him triangle and square the whole entire time? He's going to leave that cross open, all right? So this, let's just look at the crosser. Let's just look at the crosser first. Let's just see how dangerous that can be, right? Like, man, that you're going to get that every single time. But 9 out of 10, the user is going to guard that, okay? So you put X on the street or up a however you want it, right? Put a triangle on a hitch and square on a combat route, all right? And it's going to look like that. So your main read is triangle O and square all right but square is very key you need to put him on a combat route or this is not going to work okay you have to put him on a combat route so here it is play action boom guess what 10 yards every single time truck him Tr truck him 10 yards especially he's in a purple right so nine out of ten when people is like 38 39 30 and 10 guess what you throw this hitch out there Play action, he sees he's the user sees that crosser, boom, 10 yards every single time. Every single time. And then eventually what? Guess what the user is gonna do? Guess what he's gonna do? He's gonna come over there. He's gonna come over there and guard it. And guess what you got right here? The money play. Whole time. And then see what I mean? I didn't push what? Possession catch. You have to push possession catch. Now you also you can throw this uh come out route. But you have to wait for the zone to come down. Once he come down, possession catch. All right? Because sometimes the user, when you get somebody that's good, he's going to man up. He's going to man up that triangle route, thinking it's going to stop it, right? So you got enough time, so the triangle's wide open, that, that zone is going to come down. Guess what? That's another big play, another 15, 20 yards. So your main focus is really streak on him, hitch, and square on a combat route is the left hand side but if once you start getting the left hand side the user is going to start guarding that side and then of course you got your old reliable got your old reliable right here touchdown i hit people with this every single time man my favorite plays all right so what i also like to do now he's going to try to man you up right he's going to man that route up he's like you know what uh let's let's man so let's let's do man let's do man right let's go man let's go man oh play action let's go man right all right let's go man so you put him on a hitch right you put him on a hitch and look, watch what the man man do all right, it kind of it kind of guards it. Now you need to learn how to low ball. All right, once you see your opponent, once you see your opponent doing stuff like that, instead of putting him on a hitch, you see this hitch. You see this hitch on triangle. Put him on a curl triangle, and down on the left on the left analog stick. Now it goes like that. Now you want to snap the ball and push a low ball pass L two. Oh, wrong, wrong, my fault. Wrong person. Wrong person. Wrong person. He's gonna be L, hole L two and then the button bullet passing. That's going. That is going to allow your wide receiver to shield his body with the ball. So right, right here. Let me show you. Boom, and he falls down. The wide receiver, the corner is not gonna make a play on it because it's so freaking low, right? Just in case he go man coverage, right? 
Now, of course, man cover against this route right here is unguardable. You always gonna have that, right? And then touchdown, right? You always gonna have that. But, like I said, nine out of 10 times, the user's gonna guard him. So put him on a comeback route. Now, like I said, you, the X is just there to clear out in airy zones or deep zone, right? Square, square is a man beater that, that come at route, but let me show you, it's, it's risky. You have to get the time down. You see that? That's what you don't want because a lot of times the corner is going to play that, right? But that's there just in case if you don't know if he's in a zone or not. So you can put him on curl on versus man coverage. Remember that, curl versus man coverage. And then when you snap the ball, hold L2 and then the button and he's going to low pass it. See that? He's never going to get there. He's never going to get there. All right? So hole L2 is a low pass. L2 and then L1 is the high pass. All right? Now, you, you have an option. All right, that's man coverage, right? Let's, let's go back to cover three. Let's go back to cover three. Most, I'm giving you the most common coverages and things like that to get you easy win. All right, let's go back here. Let's go to cover three. Now, you, I know your question is, can I put a curl out there if I don't slide this? This for me, this cover three. It looks like man coverage, right? You never know. So, let's just say you actually put a curl out there. Would it, would it still work? Yes, it would still work. You just gotta read between square and triangle, right? See that? Boom. And I can low pass, you see, I low pass that. I can low pass that. Do you have to? No, but guess what? It makes it makes it better so the user can't get to it. Like that, boom. See that? That's what you don't want. Now I kinda rushed, I rushed that one. Now. Boom, I can still hit that one. But it's, it's, not, it's not as dangerous if you put a hitch, right? But you always, you still can hit, you still can hit triangle even if you put a curl, I mean curl out there. You just gotta hit them faster. See, it's a lot more riskier. But that's why I say, if, 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 you, if you know a zone, go ahead and put a hitch. Put that hitch and put that cover out and you isolate in that purple zone. And then boom, get your 10 yards. All right, my favorite play. And then we're gonna show cover two. All right, hold on. Oh, let's show, did I show cover three hard flat? All right, let's show cover three hard flat. Cover three hard flat, where you at? All right. Put this hitch, all right? Cover three hard flat. Now he plays the hitch, guess what you got? Square, dot, 15 yards. See that? You just gotta look. So we're not, we not even looking at the crossing route that the user's paying attention to, right? That cross route is really just bait because your two main wide receivers are square and triangle. So hard flat, boom, he got to that one. Guess what I got right here every single time, 15 yards. Now, let's, can I put a curl out there? Like you said, can I pull a curl if I think it's man coverage? Yeah, let's see what this dude this do. Boom. Remember, you need to learn how to use low ball and high pass. Never high pass, but you always low ball. You you'll know when to low ball. So let's say I didn't low ball anything like that. Possession catch. Oh, uh. see that? That's getting hard flat. Now this is a good play. Like I said, short down and distance. Boom, and he dropped it. Okay, that's why you gotta have a big body. I recommend having a big body wide receiver right there. You know what I mean? And your fastest guy on the O route. You know what I mean? So that way he he can run that crossing route a lot faster. Boom, possess CI possessing catch. Now avoid the big hit. Alright, let's go cover two. Let's go cover two. Cover two, cover two. Play action, PA crossers, cover two, Tampa two, right? Most common one. Put him on a hitch. And come back route. Now that hitch is gonna be a lot closer. Now, 
on cover two, remember, look at the corners, five yards away. So we automatically know that what? He's either man or cover two. All right, for the sake of this video, we know it's cover two. But you can kind of, kind of tell how many linebackers are out there. Like, you know, you got a corner on that side, uh, two safeties, a linebacker. You know it's some type of zone, right? Because they, they're not ne necessarily manned up uh, right underneath each other. So can I put that curl out there even though? Let's see. See, now he plays it. All right? So cover two, you cannot put a curl out there. It has to be a hitch. It has to be a hitch, right? Oh uh, shit, uh, Chris Jones fucking lighting up. Boom, quick five yards, right? Now, this is why it's so important. So you see, I'm in the cross, right? Now, he's running the cover two and he thinks he stopped it. Guess what you do? Put square audible to a half that angle play. And you know what you do? Put O on that streak and we hit him with O reliable. O reliable right here, boom, touchdown. See how that works? That's why audibles are so freaking important. That's why it's so freaking important, man. Especially when he gets in cover two like that. So yeah, he, he thinks, oh man, he got me boxed up. You know, I can't really hit this triangle. We're only getting five or six yards. You know what I mean? Even though that's still good, but I will, I will push triangle and go right back to it. And look, I audible and he don't even know it. And he thinks I'm still doing the same adjustments. And guess what? I can hit that street street route all the way down the field. Lead pass lead it to inside. I didn't push the possession catch. Let me hit it one more time. So we right here. Boom. Hit streak. Guess what? Pass lead it to the inside. Possession catch touchdown. 